So, back in 2013, I had a hard drive crash, and I lost every single Minecraft world save I ever had. That included the first world I ever played in, and also Hardcore Series 1. Fast forward to present day, I decided to spend the money to get the hard drive repaired, and take everyone on a bit of a nostalgia trip. I was not expecting what followed. I'll start again! Hey, Welcome to the stream. Alright, so... Interesting one today. Really interesting. I got my old hard drive back. The one that has Hardcore Series 1 on it. The one where I'm still alive in it. <laughs> I do not consider that in any shape or form a record, by the way, because obviously I stopped playing it because of the hard drive just sh in the bed. So it's technically, in my eyes, it's dead as dicks, right? It's dead as dicks. Okay, so I have the list of all the different release dates um, set up. So bear with me. So the first one that we're going to load up is an old server world that I used to run back in the day on a Halo forum, of all things. Oh, oh, it really doesn't like this menu. Oh, it's very laggy. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, so this is old as f dude. 2011, dude. Oh! Oh, sh Is this the right version? <laughs> that, I don't think that's meant to be as f***ed up as it is. That was the logo for the server. I wonder, the f*** is that? I think I, I think I built this. <laughs> I think I did that. <laughs> just classic things, guys. Just classic things. Oh, f***. Alright, I think I might have loaded up the wrong version. That doesn't look right, does it? That looks wrong. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> what the f*** did I do? Alright, hold up. <laughs> Give me a second. Initial spawn, glowstone tower. Dude, remember when just building a glowstone tower was the height of creativity on servers? Kind of worried that a sign's going to say something that... Oh, the old sound of chests opening up. I think I did that. There's a sky... I'm, don't worry, I'm not ignoring the sky path. I'm starting to remember what was around here now. I'm starting to remember where that takes you. I did some cool world edit stuff. We're going to go visit in a second. Woodchuck's house of awesome, dude. I'm taking some of this. Oh, I can't shift click. I have to. Oh my god. <laughs> Why does he have so many chainmail? Sh I don't. I don't know why he has all that stuff. <gasps> no way. I'm gonna fucking cry, dude. I'm gonna fucking ball, dude. Oh, fuck, I didn't get. Oh god, I did not expect to get hit with the feel so quick. <sighs> Shit. That's Matthew Adams. It's that's his. That's his name. Oh, fuck off, dude! Come on. That's Matthew's house. That was his name on Minecraft. Oh my god, he had prizes? I don't remember this. I don't remember this at all. <laughs> Look at the prices, dude. <laughs> Pretty fair, honestly. Oh, this fucking hit me right in the feels. God damn it. I was not expecting this. got a bunch of stuff in here. Well, I'm definitely going to need the fish. Because this is before you could cook the fish. Oh, man. 
Oh, it got real dark outside fast. Holy shit. Have we got a bed? No. Okay. Um. Yeah. Oh. It's spooky. Oh, that's right. I put beds in here. Okay, we'll take this. It was Matthew. He was a friend of mine. And he passed away. And I dedicated one of my builds to him on in, in season two of Hardcore. The Ocean Monument one. And at the end of the uh, the montage that you guys see, that's the sign that I put on it, uh, showing that I dedicated it to him. That's who Matthew was. I remember he played on the server, but I didn't think he had a building here. I, I built this. I remember this. So this, if I'm, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, is way, way bigger on another part of the map. I made something pretty cool that I was really proud of. Um, we might get to that if I take this. This is just a castle. Dude, it's so old. Holy sh**. It just feels ancient. Like, especially with the water as well. I don't know what the hell this is. Does it even go anywhere? Oh, it does. Are we going to see Season 1 World? Yes. Fog in chat for middle card. Where does this go? Oh, this fucking goes. Who built this? Before minecarts had sound, guys. I don't know where this takes me, guys. <laughs> it's so eerily quiet. Yeah, those are paintings. The light, the lighting kind of uh, bugged out, I think. How do I get out? Oh, you right click. So I guess this is someone's house. The world was survival. I was the only person that messed around in creative. Uh, oh. Wait, where the hell did we end up? Oh! Oh, I remember! This was the second village. I copy pasted these houses. <laughs> I think this is Anthony's house. We're going to find the sign with his name on, I guarantee it. What the f- Okay. All right, chat, do we go down this mine or do we just keep adventuring around? We go down? What the f- is this? What did he build? <gasps> oh, old bedrock fog. Oh, it's big spook. I did this. Yep. Somebody broke the glass. <laughs> Look how spook, dude, I miss, I miss the bedrock fog, dude. I really do. Look how cool it looks. Okay, I probably did this shit. I definitely did these houses. I remember that. This is 100% Anthony's house. I, I'm positive it's his house. Yep. Ant. Ant's place. I knew it. When cobblestone was the block of choice. Please read that on the most recent YouTube video you just uploaded. I had an esports show dedicated to Matthew. I did. Now, esports team. It's called... Tekka Esports, T-E-Q-R. And it was started in memory of Matthew. Do we take this? <gasps> no, no way. Was this the railway system that he set up? <gasps> oh, and I remember this house. This house was the first house that started getting griefed by Enderman, I think. Wait, was it? Now I can't even think. I don't know what that is. I think I built this. I think I built this house. What the f*** did I put in the basement? I don't want it, I don't, I don't want it, I don't want it. I don't want it. Did every single chest have the same stuff in it? I think it did. I think that was accident. I'm pretty certain that was by accident. Yep. I just copy pasted each house and they've all got the same things in the chest. <laughs> oh yeah, there's Enderman. Yeah, that was the first house I started getting griefs and I was... Oh, these guys walk way quicker, by the way. Why does nobody have a fucking weapon in any of the chests I checked? 
Oh my god. Fishing stream. Oh. <laughs> oh. Just. Okay. I set up a fishing outpost. Dude. In 2011, I was all about fishing. I still am. Holy sh. <laughs> this was the fishing spot. This is so crazy. <laughs> okay, what is this? Oh! Oh! Oh, you, that's right, you couldn't do that yet. I'm stealing stuff. I'm stealing stuff. <laughs> Pickaxe. <laughs> Let's do our way up here. I think I think Ant made this. Was it I did I help with copy paste? Let's just wait, hold on, let's check out this house before we go down there. I feel like we've gotten everything. What is that behind? Okay, there's some shit we've missed. Alco's house. Oh that's just Oh Grief, possibly? Diving board. <laughs> Peak Minecraft. Oh, you know what? Wait, I can't get out. No. Okay, you just couldn't leave beds back then. I want to go off the diving board before we go. I think I made this one. I remember placing the glue on it. You, you know when you have like a vivid memory of something? I have a vivid memory of placing the glowstone on this place. I might not have done the wood, but I remember doing the glowstone. I have no idea what the f that is. <laughs> Holy shit. I wasn't expecting to be on this world for so long. This is actual, like, nostalgia feels bomb central. We miss this. Tables? Oh. Admin and donator center? That meant to be a throne? Oh. What is this, dude? I am so confused. I'm taking this. I'm taking this. Thank you. Thank you for the meal. Um. Please let me let there be some busted gear in here. <sighs> couldn't even. Couldn't even put some busted stuff in there. Never mind. There it is. These are the gates. <laughs> I really like the world edit, as you can tell. Look at all that scuffed water. <sighs> shocking. Absolutely shocking. Oh, is this going to be the portal room? I So, I was experiment. I see a creeper just fucking running around inside there. I remember I was experimenting with different worlds on the server so I could have like multiple it was like it was called multiverse. And you could have multiple worlds running on one server, and I think this is gonna be the portal room. Maybe. Oh, there's the mountaintop house. Yeah. I think Ant built that built built that too. Uh-oh. Oh shit, there it is! <laughs> So I didn't make this. I didn't make this. I didn't build this, by the way. I threw this in here as a schematic for people to find. And when one person found it, everybody came here. Just to check it out. 
It's pretty sick. I had to kind of make up for it and like blend in where it sliced the world apart. I didn't really do a good job. <laughs> Look at the state of that. <laughs> but that is pretty huge. It's got like lava and water in the middle. It goes all the way down to bedrock. It's pretty creepy down there, as you can imagine. What with the bedrock fog. Oh god, that's the laziest world edit sh I've ever done. What the f*** is that mess? Oh, it just ends. Okay. We're gonna have to hit this water. Oh! Holy shit, that's what water used to do? That's like the biggest Monka S ever, holy f How did we survive? It's not actually that bad. Oh. <laughs> oh! It's triggered by if you can see the sky. So the bedrock fog comes in when I just do this, when I go like underneath. Whoa, dude. Alright, that's trippy as f <laughs> That's real cool. Alright, should we try another world? Main world. Hold up. <gasps> That's it. It's my first world. My actual. Wait. This is it. It's my first world. <laughs> Oh my god, it didn't show up in the list because we weren't in the right version. No wonder. Holy shit. Oh. Look at my dumb tree. Oh my god, I thought it was gone. Oh my god. <laughs> this. Okay. So this was technically the first world I fully played in, by the way. Other stuff I played in later, but this is actually 100% the world I was talking about this whole time. I have a screenshot of when I tried to build a hell portal. I was asking the forum that I used to frequent on where I should pull it, and I this is this is what I did. I was so scared of dying, I built this plateau to keep me safe. And the screenshot I took was like of this location up here. I was like, oh, I'll put the hell portal over here maybe, right? It'll make it better. Greedy, greedy Because it looked really cool. Look, oh, there it is! <laughs> this is the fattest pog. Whoa, dude, this is crazy. <laughs> dude, I was so scared back then. I was so scared of dying. Even though it wasn't even hardcore. I didn't want to die in, in that maybe that's where my hardcore Maybe maybe that's where I got my love of hardcore. Like I played like it was hardcore. Dude, what the f is that portal? <laughs> what is that? What is this? <laughs> that's a thick portal. And this ends here, yeah, yeah, this this was where I was going to keep building out. This is how scared I was of dying. I built these platforms so I didn't have to go on the floor where the creepers and the zombies and skeletons were. So I just did this, and this is how I got around. I would go mining, I would get a ton of cobble, and then I would just whoosh, whoosh, build a bridge. That is so crazy. I don't even know what's on the other end of that. I'm going to go back to my house and we're going to look at my stuff. 
I remember my cave actually gave me a nightmare. I woke up sweating because this cave that night had been such a shit. Remember what I said about being scared of dying? You'll see what I mean about this cave. It was just a mess. Look at my scuffed house. With monsters in it. So this is like a temporary place that I wanted to make a house. I spent so long making this, dude. I have 18 diamonds on me somehow. I spent forever doing this. As part of the scuffed cave. This is so cool. I've just got a huge grin on my face this whole time. <laughs> oh my god. There's my bed. Wow, that's a lot of wood. What the fuck was I gonna build with that shit? Why did I make a dispenser? Probably by accident. <laughs> I remember I was going to make a path going through this mountain. Oh, well, it's not even a mountain. In my head back then, it was a mountain. <laughs> the hill. I was going to make a path going all the way through this, like, and it was just going to keep going. And I was just going to see what I could find. Dude, I am so blown away. <laughs> the glass around the door, dude how paranoid I was. I have to have glass. I have to see what's out there. I just had the biggest flashback. Holy shit. <laughs> Standing in this exact spot. Looking at skeletons and creepers and not knowing what the fuck to do. Dude, I can't wait to see how not scuffed this cave is. In my head, all I can think of is nightmares. Actual nightmares of this cave down here. We're going to go check it out. I didn't understand why there were so many monsters. Oh, f look at that. <laughs> uh, it's pretty scuffed. This was like this when I came here, by the way. I placed the cobble. It's That's still pretty scuffed. Oh, oh f Dude, I was so sad when this hard drive died. Because look at this, man. This is history. This is my Minecraft history, dude. Oh my god, this is so scuffed. Yep, I was right. This is this is the worst. Holy shit, look at this. What is that? What is this generation, dude? I'm glad you guys I'm glad you guys are appreciating this this um this like full on nostalgia bomb. I th I honestly thought a lot of you would be like, ah, this is dumb. This is this is big dumb. But this is this is crazy to me anyway it's absolutely nuts <laughs> wow okay <laughs> that's pretty much it there's nothing else to look at in this world we could go to the nether maybe we could quickly see what's Wait, did i go i didn't go there did i no do i have any armor epic i have some iron let's make some armor Let's start, let's check out, let's check out the nether realm. I have zero memories of the nether realm. I can't think of anything. Nothing's coming to mind at all. Forehead. <laughs> Look at this scuffed stairway I did. It's when I discovered half slabs. <laughs> I honestly thought, like I said at the beginning of the stream, I honestly thought that this world was straight up corrupt and I couldn't play it anymore. Because there was just the region files. There was nothing else. But you're right. Uh, was it via Q? You're right. The version changed the way that world saves were saved. So that's why it couldn't see it. Because it was so old. It was so old that it didn't even recognize it as an actual world save. How did I even get up here? What did I do? Did I build this and just straight up fucking leave it? I think this might be it. Alright, we're 
We're blocking our way up, guys. I think I might have went through this portal and then just, like, bailed. I don't think... I don't think I did anything. <clears throat> oh. Oh, I did something. I did... I, I've got torches. And that's it. <laughs> Wait. Oh, there's a staircase here. I don't remember any of this. Oh, my God. I think I turned around. I think I came down to this point and then turned around. That was the end of my nether adventure. <laughs> Look, there's no way for me to get around. I definitely didn't, like, block my way up either. I didn't even go down there. Wait, do I see torches? Nope. Absolutely nothing, my dudes. So I made sure it was safe and then just ran. <laughs> nope the f*** out. I can deconstruct my thoughts back then quite easily now. I went round there, saw it was not safe, and then just started digging around here. I was going to make a path, like the cobblestone paths that you saw in the overworld. That's what I was up to. Oh, we're going to take some fall damage here, boys. Whew. Is there even stats? Oh, there is. Does it remember? Oh, it does. I must have died at least once. How many times did I die? Four. I've died four times in this world. I killed 21 mobs. Dude, it doesn't even... It looks like nothing. Times played 18. It looks like absolutely nothing. 1.85 hours? I spent way more time in this, I feel. Unless it just feels like that. It must have felt like an eternity back then in my little head. Must be broken. It must be. There's no way I only spent that much time. There's no way. Look at this. <laughs> this is so cool. So cool. Alright. Whew. That's awesome. That's amazing. That's really cool. Okay. Uh, next world. Hardcore attempt 2 is my season 1 world. Season 1 of Hardcore. Back from the dead. Yeah! All my dogs are here! Sick! Oh, I forgot how many dogs I had. I had so many dogs. <laughs> Saddles. I've been saddle hoarding since 2013. <laughs> See where I get my idea for my farms now? Look, it's pretty similar, isn't it? To Hardcore Series 4 Wheat Farm. I like this design. I always have. Like the tiered layers. Here's my skeleton farm. That's how I got all my XP. I was just sitting here in EFK. Let's do this. I'd leave it like overnight. And then wake up the next day. And it would be super laggy. Because it was before entity cramming was a thing. So it would be like 200 skeletons or more. Oh. Just sat here. <laughs> and I'd just throw a potion on them and they'll all die. Oh, I need to sleep. <gasps> yeah! Oh, look at this. <laughs> Did I? I was... I was balling. I was straight balling. Look how fancy my house is. Look at my enchantment room, dude. What the f*** am I doing with so many eggs? <gasps> the chicken farm! I had a chicken farm up here. <laughs> That's not sanitary. That's real bad. I didn't even have like a collection system. I would just stand here and put them in here. <laughs> pigs. Uh, there's like three layers to this. There's pigs, cows, and then sheep, I think. Oh, dude, my memory is on point. Yes, dude. There it is. 
And this takes you to the end portal room, which is in a f***ing jungle. Nice if I tried to mess with like natural looking uh, underground themes. The dog here for some reason? I don't know what this was. I think that was the entrance to my skeleton farm. Oh, dude, this is so nostalgic. <laughs> My old villager trading center, dudes. <laughs> oh, think happy thoughts. Think happy thoughts. You will be healed. Hey guys. Been a while. I gave them rooms. I gave them all their own room. And they didn't can use them. They just huddle in this corner. I wonder which ones I traded with the most. Oh, this dude. Written book? Definitely the librarians, I think. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. Paper. Paper was the one. And I could buy this. This is how I jumped in and out. I forgot. Wait, can I? There we go. I got the luckiest, luckiest world, honestly. This used to be a village, and it had a skeleton spawner underneath it. Not only that, but the stronghold is in that jungle, not 50 blocks away. This was a mushroom biome that I brought here. I built this. It's tiny. Absolutely tiny. Okay. So now, there's two things we can do. I can either walk to all the different locations I can remember off the top of my head, like my first house. Or, we can try loading it in 1.14 and fly around. Because you- oh! Never mind. I can do it through here, I think. But then again. So the difference here, right? If I stay in this version, I'm not going to know where I didn't go. Because everything's going to blend in normally. We're in the version of the game that I was playing in at the time. So new chunks will look normal. However, if we load it in 1.14, we can clearly see where where I went and where I didn't. So I feel like 1.14 might be the best bet to really see where the f I, I walked in this place. But before we do that, we're going to go to the end realm. Wait. No. No. We're going to go to the nether realm. Because my nether hub is pretty cool. It's very small, but it's very cool. Oh, yes, it's still lit. Yeah. It's going to work. Oh, fun fact. This is the last thing I built before my hard drive crashed. Episode 118. This is it. We're back. <laughs> Do you guys want to see the horrendous attempt I made at Project Bioshock? The very beginning part of me draining water. Oh boy. I think it was this way. Ah! Here it is. Is is Project Bioshock? <laughs> is my sand? This is the beginning of Project Bioshock, by the way. I had all the sand preps. I was just starting it out. I was so proud, but this this part of the ocean's really shallow, so I kind of made a mistake in putting it here. But I placed all this by hand. I did it on stream as well, I think. When I could barely stream. Oh my god, the wall is scuffed. That's triggering. That's so triggering. 
Also, guess what I built down here? <laughs> Any SpongeBob fans? Just gonna try and make. Uh, was it Sandy's? Sandy, is it Sandy from SpongeBob? Yeah, I was actually gonna make that Sandy's dome. Yep, that's what I was gonna do. I'm kind of glad I lost this world, honestly. I'm kind of glad I lost this world because it it pushed me to create bigger and better stuff. Like in season two, I just wanted to keep, I want to keep going. I want to go bigger and better. This this was pretty hype to me back in the day. But season two was like the next step up for me in terms of just like wanting to improve my my builds, wanting to, wanting to build like cooler stuff. Holy sh! Look at the fucking thing go nuts! Oh my god! Look at that! It was like the Matrix. We got we downloaded the. The schematics of every single block in the game. <laughs> it's like, Bruh. I know Minecraft. I just came from college. Why was it that you didn't like this world? Looks pretty alright to me. No, I do like it. But it represents a time in my Minecraft life slash career where I was just naive and didn't really know A, what I was doing, and B, what was like epic. You know? It represents a more innocent time, and you look back on those days and you think, meh. Okay. We are clearly going to get some issues with reloading here, because this is an old world in a new version of the game. So my stronghold was inside this jungle, and I was going to have a build idea after Project Bioshock was done, where I was going to have, like, an Aztec building that was going to be a mob spawner, like a general mob spawner. And they were going to fall onto, like, this sacrifice block. <laughs> like, I know it's a bit out there. <laughs> These were my spawn chunks in Season 1. Yikes. And multiple times, my bed would do this because of, of the way I placed it. Because I wanted it to look pretty. So multiple times during season one in the episodes, I would go through that portal and then I'm here. All right, here we go, guys. Here's where the scuffed stuff happens. Okay. This is how we know or how we differentiate what I loaded in and what I didn't. Okay. Now, don't be fools. This world was already fucked. Stuff like this happened on the rig. So this is actually normal. That's normal as well. We would see seagrass around here. If this was new. If this was a mistake. This was already here. Now I remember this quite well. Because I travelled out here. On a boat. Looking for cool shit. And you can see here. This is where. The new generation starts. So we can ignore all that. And just kind of hang around on this side. But go in like jagged sections. I was in my boat traveling across here. And this is as far out as it loaded. Ah, and there's my mushroom biome. <laughs> That's where I got the mushroom dirt from. On the mycelium. It's pretty cool. Oh, here it is. My first house, not where I spawned. I ran away. I ran this way. And then when I wanted to go to a stronghold, I had to go that way. So I basically went like back on myself. What was I thinking? I remember this oh being boy. scuffed. I, I waited. I waited. <laughs> tokens. I hope I don't waste them. Smile. <laughs> I remember. I remember waiting for this thing to spit out mobs and it never did. And I found out like way later. Oh, because I was doing it wrong. <laughs> That's awful. I love it. True. That's why I used to fish. I think that's Derek the chicken. Hey, Phil. So one of these chickens is Derek. Derek the chicken used to chill on here. In fact, did I kill Derek? Oh, fuck, I can't remember. 
I had a chicken. I had a chicken for a very long time that sat there, I think. And he was like my little mascot. I would check on him every now and again. Oh my god, I left my doors open. I left my doors open, dude. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. Let's go down here. So I used to have bookshelves down here. Oh, if you want to, if you want to laugh, if you want to see me be an absolute pepega, oh boy, check out the episode where I try to make an enchantment table with bookshelves. Oh, I literally just covered that wall in bookshelves, just flat, and then stuck the enchantment table in the middle of it. Bruh, probably the dumbest I've ever felt playing Minecraft. I wasn't really sure what the f I was doing with enchantments at all. I thought I thought Nether Wart needed water. <laughs> Here's my Nether Poles. They're probably scuffed. I'm kind of well. No, we already know. We already know what the Nether the Nether area looks like, so we don't have to go back. It's all right. We'll stay in this version. If I remember correctly, I went on a bit of an adventure across here. Yeah, I went looking for cool stuff. It might have been in a stream. Can't remember exactly, but this is definitely old terrain. We're probably going to come up on an edge soon. Oh. Alright. Okay, let's back trace where we were. I let the doors open again. Some things never change. Some things never can change. What the f I don't remember this at all. Apparently I made a house in the jungle. I made a tree house. I don't know when I did that. I have no recollection whatsoever. Oh, oh my God, dude. Was this when I was just looking for different areas? Oh my, I used to set up homes. I used to set up little huts to hide in. <gasps> I would go adventuring and I would set up a hut. And that would just be my home for a bit. New. Brand new. Okay, here we go. I think it might have been over here. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Called it. Abs oh, I left in a hurry, dude. Dude, I was fucking gone. I, I, I emptied my inventory and bailed. What the f <laughs> I knew it, dude. I remember. I remember it just being in the middle of but f nowhere. It was just in the middle of nowhere and I just I made a house. And that's that's all I remember. That's that's literally the memory. I made a house. And it was in the in an ocean. What the f This is so weird. Right, that was really cool. That's fun. Oh my god, was that just left open? Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. An enemy could have just easily dropped down here. You see what I mean guys? Everybody's a noob at some point. This is like categorically the noobest I've ever been. This is why, why? Idiot. Uh, Oof. 